Hey everyone, this is David from Toledo Antique and we got another estate sale. So we're here at the estate sale to show you around and we think you're really gonna like this one. So uh, let's go take a look around the house and show you what we can find. So at this house, they have a lot of great miniatures. This is like a picker's paradise, okay? Uh, let me show you, these are weighed thimbles. There's so much stuff here that's super cool and I've never seen before. And then down below on the shelves, there's these other miniatures like Little Red Riding Hood. Oh my goodness, there's a little fox in a bed. Looks like Cinderella. Let's see, what else do we have? That looks like, mm, I think that's Mary. Uh, there's a little dog little cats. I have a feeling that these are like a lot of fairy tale creatures. So this is like a fairy tale creature miniature collection. Looks like a little mouse. These things, some of these are tiny. That one looks like Cinderella to me too. Little pigs, little pigs. Let's see what else. That looks like a knight. It's subject to interpretation. Uh, there's a little horse. I think that's Humpty Dumpty. Um, this, ah, uh, Who's the little shepherd girl? I mean, this is really testing my knowledge of fairy tale creatures, and I'm obviously rusty. Looks like a little German party going on over here. That little one has a stick in its hand. <laughs> and then one of the miniatures has fallen over. Will someone rescue him? Then we get the sheep. Probably a little Bo Peep somewhere. Now, I am a major Dachshund fan. So there's a lot of really cool items at this house related to dachshunds and stuff that I've never seen before. Let me show you, give you an idea. Uh, this looks like a little dachshund ring holder. See how the tail's up in the air? That's probably a ring holder. And then there's a little dachshund figurine, a couple of them. It says dachshund facts. Huh, I wonder what dachshund facts. Stubbornness, 300%. Intelligence, 200%. Loyalty, 400%, and love, 1,000%. That is the reality of dachshunds, okay? So if you ever want to know about dachshunds, just come read about the dachshund facts. But let's see, we got a stuffed dachshund. This looks like kind of like a little Masonic, almost like a Masonic cushion. Um, we got some glassware, a miniature octopus, a couple really cool vases, and then some flowers for spring. Let's see what else we can find. So, I mean, there's just such a variety of things. Like over here we have, looks like kind of like deer bookends. You got like a penguin tie beanie baby, a couple bear figurines there, stuffed animals. Okay, let's see what else, what else do we got? There's a clock, just some kind of office supplies over here, so. Depends on if you need them. I mean, check out this calculator. That has like beautiful buttons. Definitely trendy. Uh, but let's take a look over here, see what we can find. There's another Beanie Baby, a couple figurines, a cookie jar. I think that's for dog cookies. And then you've got a US Army bear here. Okay, let's check this out. It says Bear Forces of America made by Ira Green. So that's a really cool stuffed bear. Huh, that looks like a little Red Riding Hood bear. And we got a couple baby dolls there. Another couple stuffed animals. You see, now this is a dachshund stuffed animal. Hey guys, what's up? How are you? Make sure you subscribe to our channel and like this video. Wow, that dachshund's really cool. He's on my side. And then you got like some owl, owl cushions. So that's really good. Ducks. I think we're going to find some more ducks around this house. Just a clue. That looks like that could be Mickey Mouse. You know, a variety of Mickey Mouse. You got a little stuffed owl. Let's see, what is this? Huh, this is like, 
maybe alabaster, an alabaster owl. So that's really cool. Got another stuffed bear. This looks like Boyd's bears to me. Oh, let's see. Yep, Boyd's bear. This one says Stife though. So the highly collectible Stife bear is represented here at the house. So you can see we got some really cool stuffed animals. Looks like there's, I mean, this is like an owl, like tea light for a candle. So you put a candle in there, the butterfly and the eyes will light up. So I know you guys are gonna love that item. And then we got more stuffed animals down here, some Thai stuffed animals. Um, there's a cool one. If you like panda bears, there's a panda bear for you. All right, so definitely some cool things. And there's even a bench. If you wanna put your stuffed animals on a bench, we've got it, we've got it. Um, okay, so now over here we have a display case. Let me open this up for you so we can see what's inside. Now the display case is even nice. It's got like bamboo style along the side. If you ask me, that's what I would call that bamboo style. But what's inside the display case is very interesting. Now, these are Gobel redhead figurines, okay? So there's a large collection of little redheaded figurines here which that's super cool. She looks like she's running, going for a run. These guys look like they're bowling. Oh my goodness, I could see why they got these. There's even dachshunds on the redhead figurines. See, she's being chased by the dachshunds, but these are Gobel figurines. Let me show you the bottom of one. You can see Gobel, original price tag was $34.50. So, you know, these, were um, slightly expensive, but there's quite a variety of these, a whole collection, as you could see. Looks like there's a washing machine going on there. And then, okay, you can see, is this? This is like the head of a nun. Oh, now these are Hummels up here, okay? So some Hummel figurines to sell. Those are great. There's even a little gnome in the back there. And looks like these figurines even have candles on them. So these are those Hummel figurines that are super cute, quite a variety, small ones to bigger ones. So definitely gonna help us to have a great sale here. Huh, I wonder what this is. So here you have the MJ Hummel Club. And you can see this is a Hummel necklace. Let me show you guys that necklace if I can. So that's super cute as well. Uh, it says something silver. Let me see if I can read that. Sterling silver. Cool. So sterling silver necklace, Hummel necklace, that's cool. This looks almost like a pewter plate. And you can see that that photograph matches that plate. So definitely some cool figurines. Even got a little pin here. It's hard to read what that says, MJ Hummel Club. So that's just one display case and that's only the top of it. It's like, let's check out the bottom. So down in the bottom here, you could see there's like an official Thai calendar. There's like a Hummel book. So uh, some collectible books down here. So that's always cool. Um, if you ever wanna learn about like a certain category of collectibles, those books are really good. And we found the resident emoji. So we've got an emoji, little, I guess you could call this a planter. I think that it probably looks like it had a lid at one time, but I think it was used as a planter. So we got a smiley emoji winking planter. Let's see. Got a couple more planters here. A little uh, elephant planter. That's cool. Here's a cactus. We got an owl planter. If anybody likes owls. And then here, I really like 
how they designed the bears and how the bears are seated on this little vintage chair. Nice woodworking on the chair. And those bears are just relaxing, so that's good. Then you got a little dog over there, relaxing on a different chair. Um, you've got some figurines of birds over there. And then you've got a nice, I think this looks like, at least it's copper toned, a copper toned metal dog planter. And it looks like something was crawling in the planter. That's a little frog. So that's like a brass toned frog. Um, got a couple more cactuses there. And then we have some more bears. Now, let's see, this one looks like Thai. That's a Thai bear. Huh. This one says Hotchkin Bear Company. Kin bears. So we definitely have a variety of bears. This one's Thai. I think there's some Stife bears here as well. I think maybe these might be Stife. Are you Stife? All right. It's got to let me know later. Let's see. This one looks, reminds me kind of of a koala bear. Um, got some wood figurines over here. This uh, is a Campbell's Soup music box. We got a little duck music box, little gnome music box. That's really cool. And I bet that this one is Schmid. Oh no, it's Gorum, made in Korea, but still very cool. And then we got another music box, that one's wood. This one is a bear that has a ribbon on it. 1987 Michigan Sesquicenten Sesquicentennial, that's a tongue twister, limited edition by Carousel. So, well, that is one room here at this house. So. Uh, obviously, we have a lot of work to do, so stay tuned. This is the Picker's Paradise, and we are going to be showing you way more stuff than this. Stay tuned to our live sales because we're going to feature some of this stuff in our live sales, so you'll have the opportunity to buy it no matter where you're at in the United States, and we'll be able to get you good stuff. So subscribe to the channel, stay tuned for our lives, and uh, we're going to show you more stuff here at the house in videos coming up. We'll see you soon. Okay, so we showed you one room at the house. There's really cool stuff even in this one room. So I think at this point, you guys are probably very excited. Now, keep in mind that we're going to be able to feature a lot of this stuff in our live sales so that we can sell directly to you. And um, just stay tuned for, for our live sales because you'll be able to pretty much let us know and say, hey, can you offer this item? Can you offer that? Um, so that'll give you the opportunity to buy and also subscribe to the channel because we're going to have a series of videos showing you the kind of stuff that we're finding here at the estate sale. Um, and then you'll be able to watch those videos and pick out the items you want us to offer. So that should be super fun and we'll see you then. Little doggies.